Hello everyone. Last night there was a second video release. Now I'm so glad that the audio file on it got distorted. As I was thoroughly irate, angry, and ticked. I need to bring up the issue at hand. Before I bring up the evidence of why me and my father had a huge overall destructive relationship in the past eight years. As I was more skeptic in that over or eight hour long rant, and my other video, I was even more. It seems this critical. This fake AI. Hello, voice, everyone. This AI moist critical was attempting to obviously rile me up. Congratulations, it worked. But now, with my mental state all well rounded, let's get into this because. Whew, I just needed a night's sleep to try to gather my mind, and even that, uh, of my well-being. I know the real Moist Critical ain't gonna do anything about this guy. Now this individual has claimed that my name is Devin Lionheart Wallace. Uh, one, no, it is not. As the first article is the video. Now, it seems the AI went back and chose a current background or the person. We're going to listen to this. Readings all it's me critical and I have some smelly shit concerning the battle between Devin. Now, all you hear he says, I'm critical. Uh, no. One, that is a mistake by the AI, and you already saw something. Well, it's me critical, and I have some smelly shit concerning the battle between Devin Foxy and Devin. You saw that white little flash? That white little flash is due to the AI software fixing the overall, and I quote, graphics. It's a way where it literally reformats the video and fix mistakes. Real video editors do not do this. So you can already tell this video is starting off great. Don't you? Devin Lionheart, or should I say Devin Wallace? Yes, I received some information about you and what you've done to your family. I have learned things. So he says what I've done to my family. Let's find out. Such as your bipolar schizophrenia and how you've been treating your poor father. You're truly an evil man, Devin. He has Okay, so allow me a second to get my medications out. My medicine cabinet, my apartment. Now, I have a very, very light acute version of bipo not bipolar schizophrenia, but it's known as ADHD. Now, uh, each one of the medicines, there's two for obviously, <clears throat> and I quote, blood sugar, one for cholesterol, one for my anger disorder, one for my sleeping deprivation, one for my depression, one for my anxiety, and another one covers, obviously, two others. The medications I take are Keplia. 
<clears throat> Levoxorin. You apply it at 42 milligrams. Levoxorin at 0. 0. 0.075 milligrams. Avastatin for 30 milligrams. Aparenzol, 30 milligram tablets. Pergina, 5 milligram tablets. Lavravel, <clears throat> 5 to 10, slash 10 milligrams. Oxycarbine, 300 milligrams. And finally, metformamine, 500 milligrams. We'll get into each and every one of these as soon as possible after this as he's uh, claiming that and we see where the graphics of the AI messed up cancer and you decide to threaten and belittle him I've also learned that you made videos you see there's the several flashes and his friends what is wrong with you Devin he is a dying man and you do stuff like this but don't worry because okay so my father yes and no right now his condition is stable it's stage four cancer and it's stabilized, but it's stuff like this that can reactivate the cancer cells and take his life. This is the subject I was trying to avoid, but it seems this individual has dug up medical records. Now, in the U.S., digging up someone's medical records is highly illegal and is punishable all by U.S. federal law. Because you know what they say, what goes around comes around. You soon will be in some deep shit, Devin. And yeah, anyways, guys, that's all I have to say on this. And with that being said, and so yeah, I'll see you guys so. in the next one. And also, so yeah, Devin, you better watch your back because you're going to deserve what's coming to you. Anyways, you guys, critical, I'd leave a like, goodbye. So, yeah, um, hmm. So, claiming I don't have my mental disabilities. Ha ha ha, very funny. So hold on, as we're gonna go to uh, Bing, and we're gonna type. I'm gonna type in each and every one of these medications. As right now, oh, I'm gonna do something called a little bit of video editing. Excuse me. So what you're about to see next is my medications and what they cover. Please be advised, I'm going to make this video 18 years or older. Oxycarbine, common brand name, Triliptal. May treat each folks old dyslexia, complex partial eclipsy. Particle eclipsy treatment adjunct simple particle eclipsy. So, epilepsy. We need to search in what is epilepsy. As we ought to have an understanding of the disability of epilepsy. A complete partial epilepsy condition causes seizures in the beginning of one side of the brain or an affected person's awareness or behavior. These seizures may last 30 to 2 minutes and may take daydreaming or staring. The person may be able to control their movements during the seizure. A particle eclipsy is the most common type of eclipsy in adults. It also is known for focal impairment and awareness issues. Now, I don't have the awareness problem, but I have known to, uh, well, as you've seen in my videos, pause. Uh, this is because of this problem. Lavalve. Lavalve is a description medication that can Contains oxyphene and misphorine and for schizophrenia and bipolar disorder. Huh. I wonder why I take this medication. Levoxorane. A thyroid, uh, uh, mithroid, loxroid, or synthroid. It is used to attract, uh, in 
decide thyroid or hypernasalism. Uh, basically, like I can't even not pronounce that fast word. That word. Um, thyroid is somebody's obviously, and I quote, weight, apparenzo, aka abilify. Now, it can be injection or pill. I take a pill. An ovulation occurs with certain mental mood disorders. Um, yeah, I'm mentally disabled. Trigena. For blood sugar. This medication is used to treat a certain mental mood and disorders. Keplida. Avastatin controls one's cholesterol. Metformamine, FDA approve a, a diabetic agent that has high blood sugars. So, uh, yeah, I will admit, huh? I I'm perfect. I'm one hundred percent perfect. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I take these medications every day. I find my own demons every day. Why? Why don't I just give in to the demons? Why don't I just let them, you know, have me in people's lives? Because I'm better than a lot of my people that are currently dealing with these issues. The next item I'm going to bring up is the condition of the house. Now, this is not for the weak at heart. Everything you're going to see is why I left the house and my father kicked me out the house. He knew it was bad, so he forced me out. I talked to him this morning over the phone. He told me the reason why he didn't want me around. He didn't want his stepson, his son of over 31 years, to see his father die, just like how his son found his mother dead. This is one of the walls in the living room. It is uh, covered in white, black, and green mold. Mold can cause several medical old conditions, such as Cancer, short of breath, asthma, and even that of infections. This is all due to an oak tree in the backyard falling on the back roof and obviously affecting the entire house. Right here what you see is a shoddy wooden ceiling put on top of the regular ceiling. Of course... The individuals that did this thought that it was work, and you can see even water dripping right here from the rain. The individuals that put it there said water dripping in the house is a normal thing. It's not. This is one of the images of the bathroom above the shower. This is the, uh, well, the results of the tree. This is also the results to the tree next to the, the overall shower as the tree claimed the roof. It's an oak tree, and it's dead. It hasn't been chopped down yet. This is also in the bathroom, right above the wash area. This is in the bathroom where the sink was yeeted out. And also, it caused tons of flooding, and you see copper piping, as the house is really dated. And now you see this. This was also in the living room. A major hole there. And you can see all this. This was in my bedroom. I was living in the garage. Because it was the biggest room in the house. And the mold was seeping in from the bathroom. So, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm sure that... Uh, that wonderful individual of an AI called Critical that should be calling himself 
Charlie, if he was accurate, would at least be the actual Charlie and contact me before attacking me. You see, unlike this imposter that is trying to be Charlie, Charlie's more of a man and he would contact someone about this on his own time. So far, I've made him aware of this through donations on his live stream to even that of subscribing to his live stream for a month. So those individuals were permanently removed from my Discord. Each and every one of them were attacking me and everyone on it, chasing off people from the Discord. They have been banned and permanently removed. They will not be joining back. As yes, currently they have been permanently removed. Ashi Systems recognized what they were doing and removed them from the server. Now I want to say this. Apologies fix nothing. Only action. As of right now, I will be focusing on my content away from this drama. This video is supposed to address what happened to me in my father's home, his current condition, my current condition, and the current issues at hand, while exposing the individual that's using a editor AI. Editor AIs take that of a video as a basic thumbnail. They copy, paste it, put it on the thumbnail of the website and put a script to it and makes a new video. The person behind this fake critical is using an AI editor and is constantly attacking and harassing me as he wishes to cause me harm. Please read the description down below as there's going to be a message at the beginning of this video imploring y'all to read that and if you're dealing with suicidal thoughts or actions I implore you please contact the suicide hotline they can help you with your issues I didn't do it because I was stronger the one thing that kept me from taking my life over three times over was the memory of my mother Telling me not to do it, that I have so much to live for. And I'm going to live my life, not only for Mama Lionheart, but for myself. Thank you everyone for watching this video. Uh.